on Cybertron, I... Well, Daniel, Spike's so wise. Plan the surprise. <laughs> well, you sure had me fooled. So, the Autobots seek to make peace throughout our galaxy. There shall be no peace. Surprise party, so much fun. You've won for everyone. <laughs> it doesn't work that way, Wheelie. No, Wheelie, you see, you've got to... Sounds like the shuttle bay. Let's go. conference starts tomorrow on Cybertron. We need it to get the Earth delegates there. You really ought to let me overhaul some of your diodes. Sure, sure. First aid, I'll need a damage assessment from you on that last shuttle. No problem. I'll get to it just as soon as I'm finished fixing up our hero here. Forget about me. The shuttle has priority. The peace conference depends on it. All right, Ultra Magnus, but don't stress those circuits till I can take a look at you. Ultra Magnus always thinks of others before he thinks of himself, doesn't he? God hurt saving me, rewarded he should be. What are you two whispering about? Uh, we were just wondering if First Aid can get the shuttle ready in time for the peace conference. First Aid can fix anything. <laughs> Let's go see what we can do to help. Remember what you said about throwing a surprise party and about rewarding Ultra Magnus? Well, why don't we have a surprise party for Ultra Magnus on his birthday? Sure, that idea, you and Ernie, for Ultra Magnus, a party! So all we have to do now is find out when his birthday is. That ought to be simple enough. Easy, that does. Just go ask! Really, it's not going to be a surprise if Ultra Magnus has any idea of what we're planning. Oh. And we can't plan anything until we find out when Ultra Magnus was created. Where to go for a date to know? Cybertron, Central Records. Come on, Willy. Now that we're here, let's find Perceptor. I'm sure he can help us. Perceptor, are you sure you can't tell us when Ultra Magnus was created? Facts of such a prosaic nature are stored in the Hall of Records. Huh? Thanks anyway, Perceptor. No time to delay. Got to find birthday. The entire history of the Autobots must be in here. Not quite. Who are you? No, 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 no. That's 
not the way it works. Who are you? I'm Daniel, and this is my friend Wheelie. Fine, fine. Now, what is it that you want? We're here for information. Meet the day of Ultra Magnus's creation. What? What's that you say? You want to know when Ultra Magnus was created? That's right. Can you help us? <sighs> Ultra Magnus, Ultra Magnus. Let me see. Now, where would that be? Oh, yes, there we are. The information you seek is not available. What do you mean, not available? Not available means you can't have it. Well, why not? Because it's on the storage asteroid. What storage asteroid? Oh, dear, oh, dear. You just don't know, do you? Long ago, during a great war, the Autobots created an artificial storage asteroid. On the asteroid was data detailing the history of the Autobots to that point. If the Autobots survived, a homing device would lead them to the asteroid. If the Autobots were destroyed, at least their history and technology would survive. Well, was the data ever retrieved? What? Retrieved? No, no. The homing device failed long ago. Technical difficulties, I suppose. Yes, technical difficulties. Well, isn't it about time that it was retrieved? But, but there's been no directive to search. Well, what were the last known coordinates of the asteroid? Oh, well, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to give you those. After all, you'd need a space shuttle to go there, and <laughs> who would give you permission for that? Uh. Oh, that's right. We need a ship to make that trip. Twenty-minute recess. Ultra Magnus. Yes, Spike. Have you seen Daniel? No, I haven't. Do you think he's lost or something? Well, uh, no. He probably lost track of time researching that school project of his. Well, Wheelie, what do you think? Which way should we?
Autobot markings, aren't they? Come on. We found the lost Autobot records. It won't open just from open. Uh, but after you, my friend? Don't know what's in store. You go first, Sudor. Come on, Wheelie. What can we do for you? Great, we're in! Bad command, bad command. Huh? Invalid file name. Who's out there? Interrupted, interrupted. Come on out and show yourselves! Greetings, greetings, greetings! Really, I think we'd better get out of here. Yes, we mustn't be lazy when robots go crazy. <laughs> That's what I sent them. Oh, yes, yes, yes. They were here, all right. I gave them some information about the old... Storage asteroid. The Autobots will want it back. Just as they will want these two back. And we will oblige them. The coordinates are programmed in Cyclonus. Permanently. Engage thrusters. Done. Really, we're moving. Correct, Earth boy. Strength on a collision course for Cybertron. The Autobots will never let that happen. They will have no choice. They will not risk destroying you. I got here as fast as I could. We're getting a signal that's a little weak. Let me give it a twitch. Uh, hi, Dad. Guess I'm in trouble, huh? Don't worry about that, son. Where are you? On the way back to Cybertron. Wheelie and I found the lost Cybertronian storage asteroid. That's great. We'll come and get you. Uh, Dad, we're not alone. That's right, Earthman. Cyclonus! Cyclonus, if you harm that boy... Do not bother to complete your threat, Autobot. I have not harmed the boy or his friend. But whether they remain unharmed is up to you. Say what you mean, Decepticon. Cybertron's coordinates have been entered into the asteroid's flight program. You will do nothing to alter its course. Ah, uh, sorry. We've lost the signal. What are we gonna do? If we destroy the asteroid, my boy will be killed. And if we don't, the delegates will be destroyed and peace will never come to our galaxy. Fuel up, Skylinks. The future of Cybertron is up to us. I 
hate the dark. No need for fright. I've got the light. <sighs> We're never gonna get out of here. Cyclonus. If my superb physique would pass through the tunnels, I would join you. Forget it. Look, if I don't return in 30 minutes, get them to safety. I'm gonna make sure this asteroid never reaches Cybertron. It's about time you return, Scourge. Reprogram the asteroid, Cyclonus. <laughs> It's a very exciting story, Daniel, but you still haven't told me what you were looking for on the storage asteroid. Well, Dad, we were looking for the record of Ultra Magnus's creation. Do you want to explain that to me? Well, we uh, wanted to throw a surprise party for him on his birthday. My birthday? I don't even know when that is. Say, I've got an idea, guys. What's that? Why don't we just designate today as Ultra Magnus's birthday? We'll have a party tonight. <laughs> All right. What we really want to know, why we not think this up long ago? Happy birthday, Ultra Magnus! <laughs> yeah, 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 good, good. <laughs> 